Creators of Left 4 Dead have officially revealed the first information on their new project. Evolve is no joke. This is a gamer's game. New wave of the next generation. The game is just so much fun. I love it. This game is right up my alley. This is a game that I really see myself becoming my next addiction. Congratulations to Evolve for winning four E3 2014 Video Game Critics Awards. It's a gorgeous game and I think it's going to do really, really well. I'm all about multiplayer games these days. Best of show, best console game, best online multiplayer, and best action game. Fun as hell. Make you think about and make you remember why you became a gamer. And we are jumping right into this game that is well underway here. My favorites here at E3 and actually a nominee for GameSpot's Best of E3 2014. Yes. It was awesome. We were just screaming on the comms. Yeah, we're... Holy, excuse me, <laughs> shit. Damn, I love playing that game. I know, it's so much fun. <laughs> Evolve is super fun. After four years of development, one delay, I closed alpha and an open beta. Maybe it's time for multiplayer to evolve. It's almost here. Monster Hunting Game Evolve makes its way to PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One this week. So let me know in the comment section down below if you guys are picking up Evolve on Tuesday. It definitely does look like a game um, I'll have a lot of fun with. I don't know how, how long lasting it's going to be though. This is going to be such a fun game to just, you know, grind out. Uh, it's supposedly just like Left 4 Dead. Evolve is a deeply rewarding multiplayer experience that packs both brains and brawn. They give it a 9! No fucking they give it a nine. There is absolutely no fun factor that comes with running circles around the map looking for one target for that long. I'm largely just doing the same thing over and over. Vince Ingenito here. I'm the guy that got to review Evolve for IGN. Like, how many games have you played in your life where you're like, yeah, I want to run some more? This was an inside job. Thank you. $15 for one, and I repeat, one fucking monster. You're giving me a gun that's painted blue, and you want to charge me $2. $130 worth of downloadable content that isn't even on the season's pass. It's not even good DLC! It's not even good cosmetic skins! Look at this shit that didn't put effort into it! It doesn't feel like it's got a, a ton of content to it. The content in this game is laughable. Do you think that it's worth $60 as it is now? Yeah. I do, I do. This scalpeling of our fucking games just to pinch more fucking dollars out of the microtransactions. Balance issues upon release and the long awaited patches to fix it. This game is often horribly unbalanced. Because of the hype and because of all the talk and all of the makers of Left 4 Dead, we're supposed to forgive that. No! And the very fact that you can't be a monster if you're playing in a party is utterly absurd. 90% of the people that were playing it are no longer playing it and they moved on to something else. Stick around, do not leave, you want to see this guy. These guys doing a pretty great job to be very competitive in a very competitive tournament. If you thought the matchmaking was bad when it first came out, now with an all-time low number of players, good luck on getting into a full lobby or getting your choice of characters now. There'll be a decent player base at launch and then seemingly overnight that player base becomes a shell of itself. And I'm not talking about like you know, the hype died down and the player base is stabilized. I mean, fucking sharp decline, uh, craziness. Hopefully, three years from now, right, when you've just, when you've bought some game and it let you down, you know, and it didn't live up to your expectations, you can always be like, you know what, I'm gonna play Evolve, because goddamn, that game, that game's still fun.